Remove the plastic caps from the coupler and rebar. Screw the coupler onto the fixed bar until it hits the end of the threading and locks tight. The bar end should be centered within the coupler. Attach the continuation bar into the coupler and rotate as far as the continuation bar will turn. Inspection of the coupler assembly is visual. For proper insulation and tolerances, instructions provided in bar US method statement should be followed carefully. SimGrip LT The SimGrip LT system is used in applications where it is more difficult to rotate the continuation bar. It is comprised of the same coupler as the SimGrip system, however, one bar is threaded for a full coupler length. Remove the bar US concrete spacer plug and rebar thread protector. Remove the plastic caps from the coupler and rebar. Attach the continuation bar into the coupler and rotate as far as the continuation bar will turn. Inspection of the coupler assembly is visual. For proper insulation and tolerances, instructions provided in bar US method statement should be followed carefully. SimGrip PS The SimGrip PS system is a position type coupler and is used where the continuation bar cannot be rotated and therefore includes an additional lock nut. The continuation bar is threaded for the full coupler length plus the length of the lock nut. Attach the lock nut then the coupler to continuation bar with the coupler against the end of the first bar. Screw the coupler from the continuation bar and rotate until it hits the end of the threading on the opposing bar and locks tight. Hold the bent rebar in its required orientation and tighten the lock nut against the coupler with a wrench. Inspection of the coupler assembly is visual. For proper insulation and tolerances, instructions provided in bar US method statement should be followed carefully. SimGrip TS The SimGrip TS system is used to splice to rebars of different diameter. Screw the coupler onto the fixed bar until it hits the end of the threading and locks tight. The bar end should be centered within the coupler. Attach the continuation bar into the coupler and rotate as far as the continuation bar will turn. Tighten the joint using a wrench on the continuation bar. Inspection of the coupler assembly is visual. For proper insulation and tolerances, Instructions provided in bar US method statement should be followed carefully. The SimGrip weldable and Bolcon are similar to the SimGrip standard coupler, however only half of one end is internally threaded, and the other end is prepared for welding. These couplers are machined from weldable grades of material depending on rebar size to conform to ASME Section 3 Division 2. SimGrip couplers are used to unite rebars to a metal object through an 8.8 heavy-duty bolt.